Hello, 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 everybody. Hello, Jonathan. Hello, Dakota. I hope you're doing well today. I hope you're both having a wonderful evening, Monday morning, and what have you. Haven't dropped any frames. YouTube seems to think that my stream health is questionable, but I feel like it's probably fine. Just got off work. I just got settled myself. I got home about an hour ago and uh, had to eat dinner and such. So here I am. Hey Dylan, how's it going? Not much is up, we're just gonna do some patron grab bags for this month because I didn't get a chance to do them over the weekend. I was hoping to get to them Sunday night, but uh, my mom's birthday ran uh, a little late, but that's alright. Well worth it, in my opinion. So, you know how it goes. YouTube is questionable. You're watching while eating pizza. Nice. I had pizza for dinner as well. Mine was leftover pizza, though. From, ye from yesterday. Yesterday? No, Saturday. I got the pizza on Saturday. Some leftover pizza from Saturday. So. For those of you new here, welcome. For those of you longtime watchers, welcome back. For those of you who are joining us in the future, hello from past Mr. Bevers, I guess. I don't know. Listen, is that how that works? I think that's how that works. So let's let's do a quick little rundown. So for those of you who don't know what's going on, we're doing patron grab bags. And what that is, is every patron who has been a patron uh, ro that rolled over for the month has their name on one of these cards right here. Okay. You're having pizza day as well, and strawberry cheesecake? Nice. So, um, everyone who has been a patron last month and has managed to roll over to this month, thank you so much for your support. Your name should show up in the credit of almost all of my videos, uh, you know, throughout the week. I know it's Monday, and you guys were expecting master Masterful Monday, and I, like a doofus, forgot to schedule it to go live at 2 o'clock. So, it's sitting there, pending, waiting... But also I noticed that it got um, it got flagged as like not acceptable for all uh, ad advertisements and stuff. And I was like, that's weird. Why is that? There's no nudity or swearing or anything in it. And its name is definitely not strange. Weird. So I was like, okay, well, I requested a review uh, for it like at lunch today while I was at work. And then I was like, I'll deal with it when I get home. When I got home, it still hadn't been reviewed yet. And I was like, <laughs> normally it doesn't take very long for them to review it and, and fix it. But hopefully they can get to it later. And I'm going to put it live after this. So for those of you watching this, stay tuned. And Masterful Monday, episode one of season two, will be live right after this stream. So there you go. Um, anyway, so... What's going on is um, everyone has their name on one of these cards, and if they manage to roll over month to month, they get an extra pull. And what an extra pull is, is if you've ever watched my Wednesday videos, my Wednesday videos are one of everything Wednesdays where I open up packs from shops from all around my area if I can, and I open up everything they have. I open up one pack of everything that that shop has to offer. If the shop has more than about, oh, let's say, 13 to 14 packs, I generally split up the videos into two so that I don't open a lot of packs in one video. I open like, you know, I try to keep it to opening at, least, at most 10 packs per video just because otherwise they end up being like 20 to 30 minute long videos and I don't really like it when they run that long. And that's just because I don't know the sets very well and I'm opening up the old cards and, you know... You're eating flatbread chicken with Wisconsin cheese waiting for a shipping confirmation from the Wizards of the Coast. Man, did you get lucky enough to, to get your Mythic Edition, Dylan? Because I definitely had both of my orders canceled. Yeah. I ordered one in the first minute. And it got canceled because it failed to process my payment. So then I reordered it, and that one went through, and then they canceled it on me. Yeah, all right. Thanks, eBay and Wizards. Super stoked about it. 
And then they sent me the refund notice, and the refund notice uh, was only going to give me uh, the money of the box back and not my import fees, my sales tax, or my shipping fee. And I was like, what the... So I called them and I asked about it, and they were like, brr. You got the message on eBay, but you don't have access to your email? Yeah. That's awesome, Dylan. Congratulations. Um... I got the email that said, too bad, my order's going to be canceled, and then nothing's happened. Hey, Rick, how's it going? You did finally catch me live. It's because it's Monday night, right? Mmm, not a normal time that you would see me live here. Actually, in approximately one minute, I would normally be streaming on Twitch, and Monday nights is normally arena night, so after I'm done this stream, I will be going to Twitch to stream some arena. So if you want to come see me do arena stuff after this by all means come swing by my twitch stream uh it's just twitch.tv slash mr bevers anyway so what let's get right into it it's because we know this is going to take a while so of course you know they've got their names on here and we, like i said we do the one of everything wednesdays where we have cards that we get from all kinds of packs so like you know future sight ninth edition unstable now this is cheaty face it's worth about three dollars I know it's not really a playable card in any format, but I figured, hey, it's three bucks. So what I did is I just included... Um, I figure this one's okay. I just included an Armada Worm with this one. Because it's at least a playable card, and it's a Mythic, so why not, right? I think I figure that's safe. Probably Limited, Dylan. I, I prefer Limited, to be honest. So then we've got our Unstable Forest, we've got a nice Is It Signet, we've got a Ganjo Castle, of course we've got Richard Garfield, PhD! we got a Steam Vents from Guild Pack, we've got Bitter Ordeal, we've got a Foil Colossus of Sarda, Sar Sardia, Foil Spider Umbra, Foil Garrix Companions, Glacial Fortress, Koth, Thrun, Angelic Destiny, Hinterland Harbor, like there's a lot of good stuff in here. I didn't realize that this card was like three dollars as well. It's a it's a common from uh, Dissension or Guild Pacts or whatever that one is. I can't remember. Burning Inquiry, a Foil Enigma Sphinx, Jace, as foretold. This is a pack of GP lands. One of these. So that Mr. B in silver is one of these. It's a sealed pack of foil Grand Prix basic lands. There's a couple of those up for grabs. Come on, go back into your slot. Dang it. Dang it. What else we got? What else we got in here? Thing in the ice, Patriarch's bidding, foil thought erasure. Nice. These full art lands like this, this waste and this, are a set of full art lands. So if you draw this, you actually get six full art lands. You get one of each type, waste included. Lightning Bolt, Faithless Looting, nice full art planes, nice full art mountain, Mystical Tutor, Foil Price of Progress, Foil Creeping Chill, Heritage Druid. Like, so lots of decent stuff in there. And that's not even the spicy thing. That's not even the spicy thing. So this is just the extra pulls that everybody gets. Everybody from this pile is going to get something from this pile. Except for the grand prize winner, who is going to get one of these spicy things. So this, right here, this Mr. B, is a sweet little piece of thing right here. Let me see if I can get it. There's this one right here. It's either this or a playmat, a Nerdvana playmat. Uh, signed by me. I can sign the deck box too if you wish. The last winner uh, wanted the deck box. Um, so there's a deck box or a playmat for that one. Or you could win these rings of Bright Hearth. Or you could win this Karn Liberated. Holy moly, look at all that spice. And we have a bunch of cards to add to this later. So for those of you who haven't seen it yet, I think this one's already been found, but maybe not. You know what? I'm going to keep both of those hidden just in case I haven't shown them off yet. I know one of them is from this week's video. So there's two more cards getting added to this pile. 
That's right, two more cards. And these cards are essentially anything that's over $40 that gets opened in the One of Everything series goes into the grand prize pool. Hey, Carl, and hey, MTG uh, Hermit. How's it going? How's it going? So the way we do this is we just... We've got Kairu, we got Jonathan, we got Milo, we got Raphael, we got Matt, we got MTG Unpacked, we got Cole, we got Eric uh, Eric W, we got Eric, we got Ken C, we got Bro Conky, we got Chris H, we got Mike V, we got Jordan W, we got Father Frodo, we got Logan Bloom, we got Rick C, we got Gamer Geek, we got Dustin C, we got Ethan D, we got Carl E, and we have Tony W. All right, and all of those fine folks have been supporting me month to month for a very long time and I really appreciate it. I hope you're all having a wonderful week start to your week. I know it's Monday. Hopefully the rest of the week flies by, right? That's what we're hoping for. Alright, Carl. Sounds good, man. Thanks for letting me know. And I'm sorry that I had to do this while you're at work. You're out of power? You're not that far away from me. Why are you out of power? You don't live that far from where I am, do you, MTG Hermit? I'm pretty sure. Okay, so let's see here. Pull me a beast within and I'll be happy. It's for my dragon deck. Okay, alright, alright. You know what, Jonathan? Maybe I can just find a, a nice beast within for you and just throw it in. Maybe, well, maybe that's something I can do for you. Um, you opened up a bundle yesterday and you got two Oketras. And sorry, I'm getting caught up on chat here since I was chatting and I was not really reading chat. Uh, who partook in the pre-release? If you did, what did you get? So, I've opened up two pre-release kits now. I didn't get to play any pre-release, unfortunately. Um, but, uh, uh, the first kit was already, you should have seen it. It was last Thursday I opened it up on this channel and showed it off. The second kit is this coming Thursday, and it was a spicy kit. It was a spicy kit. Um, not like, not like crazy spice, but like, it was pretty sweet. It was a pretty sweet kit. I don't want to talk about what was in it because, you know, the video, I don't want to ruin the video. Anyway, so we've shuffled these all up now. Don't worry, we're going to shuffle up the other stuff too. We're going to shuffle everything up, okay? So everybody is sorted here. If only I was some sort of magician, right? And then all these cards would then be my name, right? That's how this works. Like, we do some weird, crazy, fancy hand tricks. I can barely even shuffle a deck of cards, okay? Like, I can't even do the riffle shuffle. Don't ask me to riffle shuffle anything, because I can't do it. My fingers are not dexterous enough. I can do an overhead shuffle, like this, and that's about all I got going on. That's about all I got going on. You got a Bolos promo, an Oketra pack, foil, Ugin, and you pulled like nine, nine Vivians in five events. That's a lot of Vivians. You got, it's like, you know, what are you going to do with all those Vivians? You can't play them all in one deck. They don't, they do not, they're not like relentless rats. You can't have as many copies as you want in one deck. And in fact, I don't think I've seen any decks running four copies of Viv Vivian. I've seen copy. I've seen some decks running like two or three copies of Vivian. All right, who's first? Ethan. Ethan, you're walking away with a foil Garrix companion. Congratulations. Milo's next. Milo, you're walking away with a Terramander. Congratulations. Eric. Yes, grab bags. Speaking of Eric, there's an Eric. Not the same Eric, but that is an Eric. And you're walking away with a Hinterland Harbor. Congratulations. And we pulled the card first, but MTG Unpacked is getting a sweet Heritage Druid. Very nice. Tony. Tony's walking away with that Is It Signet. Very nice. Sweet stuff. Also, hi, Eric. How are you doing, man? Hope you're having a good day. Ken C is walking away with that Multani. Yavamaya's Avatar. Father Frodo. Walking away with that Tessa Karlov that also has something else. Yeah, Tassiger. You get a double rare that week. There we go. Raphael is walking away with that Caves of Coilios. Rick. Rick, my man. You're walking away with that Foil Colossus of Sardia. Well, there's a card for your EDH deck, man. 
nice and foil foil rare that's a nine nine trampler for nine that doesn't untap during your untap step but you know what's sweet about this is that you can play that voltaic servant from dominaria and just untap him at the end of every turn you don't gotta pay nine don't need to pay nine you got you got that going for you logan Walking away that Doom Whisperer. There you go, Logan. It's not a land. I'm sorry. Logan likes to collect the uh, the unstable lands for me. He's gotten one, like, probably, I would say, at least four times. Cole F. is walking away with that Desperate Ritual. Dustin is walking away with that Thrun. Oof. Sorry, uh, sorry, Hermit. Dustin walked away with your Thrun. Kairu Kairu is walking away with that Bitter Ordeal. There you go. It's pretty nice. Chris, one of our newest... Patrons, walking away with that cheaty face. That cheaty face that's hiding in Armada Worm. There you go, Chris. Congratulations. Mike V, walking away with that Burning Inquiry. Matt N, walking away with a Foil Thought Erasure. There you go. Nice, the, Vi the real Viking MTG right there. Jonathan. Ooh, Jonathan walking away with that as foretold. I know it doesn't help you with your green deck, but there you go. There, it's a pretty sweet card, though. Pretty sweet card. Carl walking away with that Alvin, Alvinwald Hydra. Okay. Gamer Geek walking away with that Iganjo Castle. And Eric, Eric W walking away with that. Full Art Forest from Unstable. There you go, Eric. Almost made it to the top again. Top three for you. Broke Honky. Broke Honky. Walking away with that Patriarch's bidding. Guess what? <laughs> who complained about this last week? Who complained? Who was second place last week? Or last month, I should say. Who was second place last month and almost won? And who is the person who's here who's saying their phone connection seems to be screwed up, though, and the data is super slow? Jordan! <laughs> Someone type to him in chat and tell him he won. Because maybe he can't see the video very well. <laughs> That's awesome. So Jordan actually came second last week and was super, he was like, oh man, I was so close to winning. And he was, he was super close to winning and he just didn't get there. Corden. <laughs> Jordan. Almost. That, yeah, that K and that J are right beside each other, eh? Jordan, you won! So, lots of stuff in here. This Steam Vents is actually, like, almost $20. I didn't realize. It's, like, crazy. Jordan, you win! There's that Richard Garfield in there still. Man, there's some sweet and a thing in the ice. I didn't realize this card was so expensive. Everyone was like, that card's way more than what you said. And I was like, it is? And I went and looked it up, and I'm like, huh, so it is. There's a Jason here still. There's a Koth in here somewhere, isn't there? We didn't give the Koth away yet, right? Oh, there's Koth. So there's still two walkers in here as well. Very nice. Very nice. And and just so we're clear, I won't show. Yeah, it is you. It's totally you. You win one of these yellow ones. So these right here, these two yellow sleeves and all these red sleeves are being added to the pile for next month. Like this is all new stuff. This is all new stuff that's being added to the pile. Stuff that was opened for last Wednesday and this this coming Wednesday. All right. I'm going to shuffle these up. I don't know if you saw what they were. We're going to shuffle them up. There's three of them here. Okay. Okay, Jordan. Do you want me to roll a die or do you want to pick? I don't know if he can hear me. Let me see if I can type to him. 
die. My my keyboard is like not. Eh. 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 Because we can do either. We can do a die roll or we can pick. All right, I think I have some D6s. Middle? All right. Middle. Let's reveal what you didn't get. No playmat or deck box. No Karn. How about rings? You want some rings of Bright Hearth? There you go. Congratulations, Jordan. You're getting that sweet rings of Bright Hearth. I wonder if I can, like, can I make it so that you can actually see it? Is it, it's not really, it's not really the best, is it? It's kind of, like, blurry. So, congratulations, Jordan. There you are. We can throw that away. Ugh! Now we get onto the meat and potatoes. You guys think, oh, it's over. It's over. It's done. Wrong! 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 Sorry. Um. That was just me channeling. Inner, inner. Inner thoughts, inner thoughts. Uh, okay, well, Jordan, we'll do your grab bag first. We'll do your grab bag first since you, you're here. And uh, that's really, really cloudy for some reason. I don't know why. It's actually the perfect... It's actually, it's actually this sleeve that's cloudy, which is kind of weird. So there it is. Like, look at that. It looks way clearer now, right? Like, look at that. So it's actually this um, eclipse sleeve that's super cloudy for some reason. Don't know why. There it is. All right, Jordan. So you're walking away with that rings of bright hearth, and let's see what you get. Finally, you finally got there. Ovia, Parshiri Sage, Dual Caster Mage, Expedition Raptor, Sylvan Might, Essence Depleter, Delirium Skeens. Devout Harpist and Stern Constable. And your foil is a perilous predicament. And your common or uncommon worth a dollar or more. Boom! Jetaxian Probe. There you go, Jordan. Thank you so much. It's currently watching at 144p. Perfect. Perfect. The highest of quality. All right. Well, there you go, Jordan. Thank you so much for your patronage, and congratulations on the grand prize win there. Bro Conky, you were close, man. You've already won a week, or you've already won a month, though, so I mean, like, that would have been second one for you, wouldn't it? But you did get a Patriarch's bidding, which is pretty sweet. Let's see what your grab bag holds. Boom! A Hero's Podium. And Hanawir Militia Captain. Silvok Explorer. Una's Grace, Crack Clan Stoker, Learn from the Past, and Gnarled Mass. And your foil is a Queen's Agent. And your common or uncommon with a dollar or more is a Knight's Whisper. Congratulations, sir. Thank you so much for your patronage. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy your grab bag. And there you go, Mr. Broke Honky. All right, who's next? Eric. Eric, you're next. You're here. Are you ready? Boom. Mystic Snake. With Amunda's Vanguard. And Rock's Brute. Mist Hoof Kieran. Emperor Crocodile. The old rare that's now a common. Setizen Oathsworn. 
uh, repopulate and wolfkin bond. Your foil. Boom! A sentinel spider. You got a lot of green. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, and a half, and another half. So basically six green cards. Well, okay. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven green cards. Which, but two of them require other colors. And your common or uncommon with other more? Boros Charm. That's not green. You got a Boros Charm, though. Congratulations, Eric. Thank you so much for your patronage. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy. More for the... Yeah, that's true. I guess it knew what you got, didn't it? It was like, he got a forest. Give him a bunch of green cards. Sometimes... Life is a strange thing, isn't it? Sometimes life is a strange thing. Gamer Geek gets two grab bags, and they're walking away with that Iganjo Castle. Boom! Coax from the blind eternities, and a long forgotten Gohi. Alright, and Videlkin Engineer, Werebear, Illusionary Informant, Duskwood Bailoth. Harbinger of Spring, and a Menriki Gusari. And your foil is a comparative analysis. And your common or uncommon with or more, an Ash Barons. Who can complain about a little Ash Barons, right? Don't worry about it, Eric. My typing is bad every day. So, if you have good days, you got, you got one up on me. Gamer Geek. Second grab bag. Sandworm Convergence, bomb. It's a bomb card. Ire Shaman, Machin uh, Machinite, Elvish Vanguard, Crazed Goblin, Treasure Keeper, Yavamire Granger, and Shadow Rider. And your foil is a Sylvan Bounty. And your common or uncommon with dollar more, a Relic of Progenitus. Very nice. Me bad at type. Type bad, yes. Keys go click. Word come out. There you go, Gamer Geek. Thank you so much for your patronage. I really appreciate it. There's your grab bags for this month. And let's move on to Carl. Carl's next. Carl's getting that Alvenwald Hydra. And Carl also gets two grab bags. So first off, Sulfuric Vortex. And Inkwell Leviathan. Big old Inkwell Leviathan. Dwarven Lightsmith. Phantom Monster. Echoing Courage. Outnumber. Radiance Judgment. And Imperial Armor. And your foil. A Glacial Wall. A nice 07 Defender for three. Goes perfectly into your uh, Arcades deck. Let me tell you. And what with H Whatley out there now? Perfect. Watley's perfect for that deck. So, and now you've got a nice foil wall to go with it. Gatekeeper of Malakir. Very nice. As your common or uncommon worth a dollar or more. Sweet. Sweet, sweet candy. Carl, your second grab bag. Ba boom. Temple of Abandon. And Jorian. Ruin Diver. Fill with Fright. Extricator of Sin. Enlightened Maniac. Synchronized Strike. Pacifism from Urza's. Look at that sweet pacifism. And a Civic Wayfinder. And your foil is a Wasteland Viper, which is also a sweet card. Nice Grull Rush deck for sure. And your your common or common with dollar or more is an Indulgent Vampire. An Indulgent Aristocrat, I should say. No worries. No worries, MTG Hermit. Sorry that your your power and internet are out and that your phone is being a butt. So have a great night. I hope your power comes back. And uh, thank you so much for your patronage, Carl and everyone else. All right, Jonathan, you're here. What's up? What did you miss? You didn't miss your grab bag yet, Tony. You've only missed your additional pull. Okay? We haven't done your grab bag yet, so stay tuned. Jonathan, Jonathan, what were you walking away with? Jonathan, you're walking away with that as foretold... Let's do your grab bag. Boom! Call the gate watch. There it is. Search your library for a planeswalker card, reveal it, and put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. 
seems pretty relevant to this current standard environment. And a Jareth, Leon Titan. Cool. I just saw actually that the the original artist uh posted this on Twitter the other day. Or like somebody posted that that the original artist had released the original art for it a while back, I guess, and and people just didn't know. But there's actually like this card is interesting. The the feathers or the uh, the flowers around his neck actually don't exist in the original art. So the flowers around his neck aren't actually there in the original art. Wizards added it in. He's holding, I believe, yeah, he's holding a skull in his hand. And actually below him, like if this was full art, there's a bunch of like corpses around his feet. It's pretty crazy. Anyway, your your common pulls were Razorfoot Griffin, Fog, Chitness Cloak, Pallid Mycoderm, Psychic Spear, and Yavamaya Worm. And your foil... Boom! A Cavu Climber. And your common or uncommon with a dollar or more? Unmake! Nice. Unmake is a solid removal spell. Very good for Popper. If you play any Popper, or if you don't play Popper, you should think about it, I guess. Since I'm giving you all these commons and uncommons, I guess. Popper is a solid format for those jank, junky commons that you've got kicking around. Let me tell you. All right, Matthew N, or the Real Viking MTG, has got that foil thought erasure. Let's see what else. Cultivator's Cavern, Caravan, I should say. Blip, blip, blip. Pia and Kieran Nalar, and Cathodian, Toppelgeist, Nature's Claim, Cathari Bomber, Midnight Duelist, and Lithomancer's Focus. Yeah, don't worry, Jonathan, I'll get you covered. I'd get you covered. Wayfaring Temple as your foil, which was originally a rare in, I think, Dragon's Maze. Uncommon in Modern Masters. So, interesting enough, it's a it's a foil uncommon of an old rare. And your common or common with a dollar or more is Chain Lightning, which is a solid little spell. Who doesn't like a little Chain Lightning here and there? So, there you go, Matthew. Thank you so much for your patronage. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy your grab bag for this month, and there it is. Plunk it away into your bag. And let's see here. We've got Mike. Mike V is next with that Burning Inquiry. Or Burning Inquiry. I don't know, how do you want to pronounce it? You're getting an Indulgent Tormentor. And Insidious Will. Along with Second Thoughts. Moonlight Hunt and Incendiary Sabotage, Sylvan Messenger, Pouncing Jaguar, and River Boa. And your foil is a Chandra's Outrage. Very nice. And your common or uncommon with dollar or more is a Rancor. So there you go, Mike. I hope you enjoy. Thank you so much for your patronage. That's your grab bag for this month. There it is. I think Mike, you won the you won the grand prize last month, so I hope you're enjoying that foil wasteland. I think is what you got, isn't it? I believe that's what it was. Chris, Chris H, walking away with that cheaty face with the armada worm hiding behind it, because you know cheaty face just likes to cheat things in. Wasteland strangler, Jin of wishes, pulse of Marasa. frantic salvage, borrowed ma malevolence. Tawcrop Skirmisher, Kami of Tattered Soji, and Kessig Dire Swine. And your foil is a Waxmane Baku, which is pretty cool. Waxmane Baku is a nice card. And your common or common with dollar more is Hydro Blast. There you go, nice little blue common instant. It lets you blow away those mono red decks. Silly mono red decks. Popper's starting to make your EDH commons too expensive. I guess that's fair. I guess that's fair, Jonathan. <laughs> You're not wrong, I guess. Kairu Kairu walking away with that bitter ordeal. All right, Kairu Kairu, let's pull your grab bag. Boom, Sigarda's aid into Death Lock Trap. Or Deadlock, Deadlock Trap. Tar Snare, Rise from the Tides, Emancipation Angel, Instill Infection, Bread for the hunt and 
Compost. A compost, which is an enchantment. Look at this. Whenever a black card is put into one of your opponent's graveyards, you may draw a card. Interesting. Very situational. And your foil is an Evolving Wilds. All right. Can never have enough foil Evolving Wilds for your decks, that's for sure. Monastery Swift Spear as your common or uncommon with a dollar or more. So there you go. Kairu Kairu. Thank you so much for your patronage. I really appreciate it. I gotta send out you got. I gotta send out your uh, your discount codes, don't I? God, there's so much to do in so little time, guys. There's so much to do in so little time. All right, Dustin C is walking away with that thrun or thrun or whatever you want to call it, and Dustin gets two grab bags. Let's see, Avison, Guardian Angel, into Advent of the Worm, Innocent Blood, Swift Spinner. Alley Strangler. Eh. Uh, this one. Ojatai's Breath. Petalmane Baku. And Vessel of Ephemera. Oh snap, it's Milo. And your foil is an Aegis Automaton. And your commoner on common dollar or more is a Kodama's Reach. There you go. Dustin, that's your first grab bag. Let's pull your second. But boom! Call the gate watch. There it is. Super solid for these for this time. Siege Gang Commander. You missed your extra pull, but not your grab bag, Milo. Arbor Elf. What am I doing? Uh, compelling deterrence. Did I pull from this side instead of that side? I don't. I don't know what I was doing. Burden of Guilt. Ivy Elemental. Spell Shock. And Mana Chains. Cumulative upkeep? What? Say what? It's a one mana enchant creature. Enchanted creature gains cumulative upkeep one. Dear God. That creature would be dying by turn three for sure. You're like, I'm not paying three mana. Get out of here. And your foil is a glint nest crane. Nice little glint nest crane. And a voltaic key. Very nice. Nice. It's okay, Mr. B. It's Monday. It's true. It is Monday. Friggin' Mondays. Looks like somebody's got a case of the Mondays. God, no, man. If someone said that in my work, they'd get beat up. Cole F. Walking away that desperate ritual. Getting that release the gremlins. And pyrokinesis. Spinal parasite. Bound by Moon Silver, Emancipation Angel, Bloodlust, Bloodlust Insider, Burst of Energy, and Thirst. I'm so thirsty, thirsty. In your foil, ooh, a foil rare, Apocalypse Demon. There it is. Noise and Mutagenic Growth. So there you go, Cole F. Thank you so much for your patronage. I hope you enjoy your grab bag. There it is. I, Milo, I remember what you got as your extra pull, and you're going to be like, what? I don't need that. <laughs> You'll see it when we get there. Logan, walking away with that Doom Whisperer. Boom, imprisoned in the moon. And Woodland Wanderer. Along with Sproloth Ancient. Uh, Sp Sporoloth Ancient, Spectral Shepherd, Bone Size Ready, Absorb V, Bouncing Beebles, and Shadow Guild Mage. Along with a Foil Gideon's Reproach, much more like the Divine Arrow of now. And you get a Rancor from Urza's. There you go. So there you go, Logan. Thank you so much for your patronage. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy your grab bag for this month. There it is. There you go. Who's next? Rick is next. Rick's got that foil Colossus of Sardia. And Rick gets two grab bags. So let's pull Rick's grab bags. Archfiend of Depravity. Ash Zealot. Uh, Nirkana Assassin. Incinerate. Wake the Reflections. Balustrade Spy. Warrior of Uncore. Amara Entangler, and your foil is a glass blower's puzzle knot. Who doesn't want energy in their EDH deck, right? 
and a, a spider umbra. A spider umbra is pretty sweet. Hello, Arvagos. How's it going? Right, I need to do the other thing too. God, I was supposed to do that this weekend. I am so bad at this. I'm so bad, everybody. I am like the worst. Rick, you get two grab bags. What am I doing? Bruh. Temporal a Trespass. Mythic. I get so... Collective Effort. Noise. Collective Effort is a very good card, actually. Sun Colored Raptor. Reckless Scholar. Vol Volcanic Rush. Active Heroism. Kindle. And Satyr Grove Dancer. And your foil is a Pith Driller. Hey, Phyrexian Mana, you can cast that no matter what your deck is. See? And Jataxian Probe. So there you go, Rick. You got a nice Mythic to go along with the rest of your stuff here. See, I knew I was like, I was like getting sidetracked. I'm doing okay, Ar Arvagos. I'm like going crazy these days. I've got so much on my plate and like, I just am like not getting enough time to do all of the things. Raphael is walking away with that Caves of Coilios. Boom! Sage Eye Avengers and Cultivator of Blades. Loam Larva. Gibbering Fiend, Fists of Ironwood, Necrobite, Sentinel Spider, and Core Scythe Master. You got a promotion today at work? Sweet. Congratulations, man. And your foil is a lull. And your common or uncommon with a dollar or more is this one. Do you want that one instead? It's too bad. You get this one. Mutagenic Growth. Too bad. You get the one I pulled out. Not the one that came with it. Raphael, there you go. Thank you so much for your patronage. That's your grab bag for the month. I hope you enjoy it. You're now the shop supervisor. Awesome. That sounds rad. All right. Father Frodo walking away with that. Tasa along with a... Uh, what's his name? Tassiger. Getting a marionette master. A ground seal. Wild onslaught. Inner struggle. Take Inventory, Sacred Cat, Trumpet Blast, and Press for Answers. And your foil is a foil rare, Tamio's Journal. Nice. Tamio's Journal foil is pretty sweet, actually. And Tamio's Journal is just a solid card. I mean, every turn it makes and it, it gives you a t clue token. And then you can sack three clues to just search your library for anything. So, and you don't have to search the journal to get there, which is pretty sweet. And you get a Relic of Progenitus. Very nice. So there you go, sir. Thank you so much, Father Frodo. I hope you enjoy your grab bag for this month. <laughs> I hope it comes with more money, too. I would hope so, too. If it, if you get a promotion and they don't give you a pay raise, that would be pretty upsetting, wouldn't it? Ken C. walking away with that Multani. Mind Shatter. And Detention Sphere. Detention Sphere is a sweet card. Dragon Bell Monk, Fugitive Wizard, Thought Harvester, Duress, Uproot, and Dazzling Reflection. Foil. We got to pull a foil. Foil, Weldfast Wingsmith, and a Counterspell from Ice Age. So there you go. Ken, thank you so much for your patronage. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy your grab bag. There it is. There it is. There it is. Your grab bag. There it is. Looking weird. Tony W. You're here now. See, you didn't miss. We're going to do two grab bags for you. You're walking away with an Is It Signet from Guild Pact? I think that's Guild. Is that Dissension or Guild Pact? I don't remember. I don't remember set symbols. I don't remember set symbols. Anyway, first grab bag, a lantern scout, and a fairy's band war chief. Fairy's band war chief. Legion crusader, or conquistador, I should say. Gift of tusks. It of the horrid swarm. Dread drone. Splinter. And razor tooth rats. Your foil is a Skirk Commando, 
and your common or uncommon worth a dollar or more is a timely reinforcements. Timely reinforcements is also another solid card. High pitched guilt pact? Is it guilt pact? I don't know. Maybe. Could be. Maybe it's guilt pact. Eldrazi Ob Obligator and a Conflux. Now you can cast all those five color spells, right? Perfect. Spore Swarm, Cemetery Recruitment, Isolation Zone, Revoke Privileges, Weathered Weather Seed Fairies, and Fall of the Hammer. And a Foil Scion Summoner, and your Common or Uncommon with a Dollar or More. Ooh, this one. Boom. Spell Snare. Nice. And that's an original Spell Snare, not one of the ones from the uh, Master Set reprint. So there you go. Thank you so much, Tony. I hope you enjoy your grab bags for this month. Urgh, urgh, urgh. I appreciate your patronage. Thank you so much. And there it is. All right. Heritage Druid is next for MTG Unpacked. Walking away with that Heritage Druid. Let's see. Boom. Uh, Munda Ambush Leader. Aether Mage's Touch. Jadecraft Artisan. Strange Augmentation, On Crop Crasher, Greater Sandworm, Call for Blood, and Stern Constable. With your foil being a Shoreline Ranger. And your common or common or more, Chain Lightning. It's Grease Lightning. I mean, Chain, li chain Lightning. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm not really sorry because I keep doing it. And if I was really sorry, I would stop, right? Isn't that... That's how it works? I think that's how that works. All right. Eric. Eric's getting that Hinterland Harbor. Boom. Sram's Expertise. And Xanid Swarm. Oof. Xanid Swarm. Pouncing Cheetah. Open the Armory. Avarax. Unburden. Wild Dogs and Night Market Aeronaut. Don't squeeze too hard or you hurt yourself. Maybe. Maybe I want to hurt myself. Maybe I'm into pain for pleasure. You don't know me. Insolent Neonate as your foil. That card actually used to be worth some money. Mainly because it was a one mana, uh, one one with menace that you could discard a card and sacrifice it to draw a card. So it was a sack mechanic for your madness cards. Dis distant Melody. So there you go, Eric. Thank you so much for your patronage. I hope you enjoy your grab bag for this month. And your extra pull there. All right, Milo. It's your turn, man. I know you've been waiting. You've been waiting patiently. It's your turn now. Are you ready to see what your extra pull was? You get a, a Terramander. You don't have any of these yet, right? I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure you don't have any of these, right? There you go, Milo. <laughs> you're getting that Terra Manor, and you're gonna get a Grand Warlord Radha, and an Impetuous Devils. Eh. Let's go with this Horned Kopesh, Ogre Resistor, Kozalex Pathfinder, Revealing Wind, Seal of Cleansing, and Angelic. And your foil is a Trumpet Blast. Who doesn't like a little Trumpet Blast? And a Ghost Quarter. Look at that fancy little land right there. Sweet Ghost Quarter, man. Now you can put that in your cube and have someone with a land destruction build. Right? That's how it works, I think. Right? Terramander does rock. I agree. That's why he's in here. Because, I mean, all the cards that are in the extra pull pile, I've double-checked everything. Everything that's in that pile is at least a dollar. So, I mean, like, it means he's good. So, this foil Garrick's companion for Ethan, and Ethan gets two grab bags. Uh, Tempered Steel. That's a good rare. And Imprisoned in the Moon. All right. Let's see. Naturalize. Enormous Bailoth. Golgari Rotworm. And I'm sorry, I didn't say thank you, Milo. Thank you so much for your patronage. That's your grab bag. I apologize. Thank you so much for your patronage. There's your grab bag for the month. I hope you enjoy it. We got Anticipate and Ideas Unbound, as well as Dread Waters. And next, 
your foil a Warren Pilferers with your common or uncommon work being a lightning bolt. A lightning bolt. Lightning bolt, lightning bolt, lightning bolt, lightning bolt. Let's uh let's do this. Can we can we do this? Eh. I'm gonna have to get more of these. I'm gonna have to get some more commons and uncommons sleeved up and put into this box. Alright, your second grab bag, Ethan. Corrupted gra gravestone. Kithian's in irregulars. Dusk Charger. Thraben Standard Bearer. Labyrinth Guardian. Grim Contest. Opal Champion. And Tandem Lookout. And your foil is a madcap skills. You got skills, Ethan, and they write off that cap so much so that you would call them mad. And your your common or common dollar more is a nice sweet blood artist. There you go, Ethan. Some nice aristocrat playable right there. Boom. Kairu, Kairu, how's it going? We, yeah, we just finished Kairu Kairu, so you got here just at the end, so no worries for taking off. I hope you have a good Monday. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. We had uh, our winner this week was Jordan. Jordan Williams. Or MTG Hermit, as you might know him in chat. So there we go. That's it for the grab bags, everybody. Now, I owe some other people things. Let me see. Do I have that open still? Okay. So, for those of you who are watching my Master P my Master F yeah, my Masterpiece Monday, you'll know that we did some extra rewards. So, Mike Anderson is owed two packs of War of the Spark as well as a relic token of lineage. And Robert uh, Brentzel is owed two packs of War or Dominaria, whatever I can get my hands on. Um, and Corbin of Corbin Card Games Corner is owed one pack of War of the Spark. And Moholnik is owed one pack of War of the Spark. Then we have a few other people. Our, uh, MRF388, who's owed a pack of Eternal Tokens. Eric Schlick, who's owed a pack of Lineage Tokens. And Arvagos28, who is owed a pack of either of those. So, I want to do that all as one video. I don't have the War of the Spark packs to open right now, and I've actually got two people who have not replied. Um, Jay Shing, I know, wants me to open something for him, but he wants me to do it with him in person, because he lives around here. So, I'm going to do that with him. So, that's going to be off of the video, obviously. Um, but I haven't heard back from Zach... Sesulka. Um, so there will be a video coming for those. I promise there is. I haven't forgotten about it. I have it all written down in a spreadsheet here. Um, so there is a video coming for that, but I don't have the War of the Spark packs right now. And I don't have... Oh, I mean, I have all the token things, so I could do that now if I wanted to. But I'd rather do it all together. Um, so it will be in the next couple days. Um, it will be in the next couple days. Maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. I don't know yet. Um, we'll have to see. It'll depend on when I can get my hands on the War of the Sparks packs from my LGS. I'm going to have to go pick them up. Um, so anyway, that will be coming, so don't worry. Um, that's coming soon. There will be another stream, essentially, for that. Um, and for those of you who are here now, I am going to be ending this stream, but I am going to be starting up a stream over on twitch.tv slash MrBevers where I'm going to be streaming Arena. I'm going to be doing some MTG Arena tonight, and we're probably going to be doing some drafts. Um... Or maybe some sealed. It'll depend. I think I want. I'm thinking I'm gonna do sealed because I want to play some more with the spark, and the drafts are not so great. Um, no worries, Tony. That's that's okay. Everything's here, so you can always come back and watch the video. Um, I know work is sometimes hard. It's distracting, right? Can't work just like not get in the way of what we enjoy in life, right? That's what I. That's what I wish. I wish that work wouldn't get in the way of the things that I enjoy. But it definitely does all the time. So anyway, um, so I owe those packs to people. I will get them opened up and I will get them mailed out. Don't worry. So they will be mailed out this week uh, to those of you who are owed those things. And um, uh, thank you so much, everyone, for being a patron. I really appreciate it. Don't forget also uh, my Master Full Monday series did start up this weekend. I filmed it this weekend. 
Uh, it was supposed to release today at 2 p.m. And I biffed it. I biffed it. I forgot to schedule it to release it. So it's going live. I'm going to be putting it live right after I end this stream before I go live over on Twitch. So if you're going to hang out and watch me on Twitch play some arena, come on by, say hi, talk and chat. Maybe, uh, you know, make me make some misplays or make me play cards that I shouldn't be playing. Who knows? There's lots of options. Um, I also have the chat draft uh, application. So if you're watching through your browser, you can actually vote on what I should draft um, through the browser. It's just an add-on that I have on my side. It doesn't require you to install anything. So there is that. Uh, Raphael, yes, we just finished up. Um, but the stream here is ending. But I'm going to be going live over on Twitch momentarily playing some Arena. So if you want to come watch me on Twitch, you totally can. Again, that is just um, my Twitch link, which is, I believe, is it in the description? I don't even think it's, it's not in the description. But, like, it's um, www.twitch. Oh, my God, this would be so much easier if I just, like, pulled it up from here, wouldn't it? Uh, where where are we? Mr. Bevers, like this? And then just copy it? Yeah, this would be, this would be way easier. Why? I'm, I'm, I am a very silly man. Paste. Am I going to be able to paste this? There we go. Boom! You're going to go play EQ, too? And you're going to go play WoW? All right. Have a great night, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for being here. Don't forget, if you want to come watch me play some Arena, by all means, come hang out. I'm over there on Twitch. I'll be there live in probably about 10 to 15 minutes. So have a great night. And also, the Master Full Monday, Episode 1, will go up right after this uh, here on YouTube. Don't worry, Raphael. It's all good. Thanks for being here at the end. I appreciate it. I appreciate you stopping by. Have a great night, everybody. We'll see you all next time.